Now, joining us is Scott Paul. He's the president of the Alliance for American Manufacturing. Scott, welcome to the program. Good to see you, sir. Yeah, likewise. Good to be with you, Stuart. Okay. What is the single most important thing for you from the president's speech today? What is it the most that you want to hear? I think that there are two things that the president needs to get across. One is that how does this impact middle America? To the point about Gary Cohn uh, and, and the missteps uh, in his briefing yesterday. I think that's critically important. The second piece of this, and I do think he's talking to the right audience about this, is how tax reform is going to make our companies more globally competitive and therefore is going to be able to create additional good middle class jobs. Okay. These are jobs that have a great spillover impact. He has to make that case. Now, the president wants to drop the top corporate tax rate to 15 percent. The plan at the moment calls it to go down to 20 percent. If it stays at 20 percent, if it comes down to that 20 percent figure, is that low enough to bring back much of the two and a half trillion dollars that our companies have overseas that doesn't come back here because of our high taxes? Is 20 percent low enough? Stuart, I think it's a great question, and that rate's going to impact different sectors in different ways, depending on the other deductions that they're, they're giving up. On net, I'm hopeful that we can come up with a plan that will do that. I do want to quickly add that the last time we tried a repatriation in the Bush administration, uh, it wasn't a job creator. It, it brought some revenue back, uh, but it was largely used to buy back stock, uh, to pay down corporate loans, uh, and it certainly didn't have an impact on manufacturing jobs. Uh, and, and we piled up additional public debt uh, in, in the course of this. So I think the approach has to be a little bit different this time. We need to make sure uh, that we're incentivizing these companies really? uh, to make would good you, choices second, in the United would, States. You, would you put strings on it? We'll drop yeah, look, the rate to 20% only if you bring the money back and create more jobs. Is, are you well, put there's those strings two on? issues here. There's the, there's the one-time repatriation. Uh, and there, I do think you need to put some strings on it. I, I mean, doing stock buybacks, doing uh, loan payoffs uh, may benefit a narrow band of folks, but it's not going to broadly help the economy. If we can pour it into bonds that will fund infrastructure or investing in capital expenditures or investing in the skills of our workers, uh, that's the type of, of money coming back that's going to have broad economic benefits uh, and is going, to, is going to help the corporation add value as well. Okay, uh, Scott. I think we uh, need to learn from that as we move ahead. Okay, I understand and I'm listening to you. We will hear from the president momentarily. Scott Paul, thanks very much for joining us, sir. Appreciate it.